Hello and welcome to our Juman conference. I'm so glad you could join us today. From the very beginning, we had a tradition of annual conferences, and it has been my dream to bring this conference to our office so that you could feel the energy of our team who work hard to help reach customers all over the world. 2020 has changed everything, and in the long run, it gave me an opportunity to invite you all to our brand new office. Today, early 21, life is good in June. We've kicked off the year with the most successful sale outside of traditional 11.11 and Black Friday. GMV is growing, customers are happy. For instance, in Germany, our core and strategic market, Joom, has the best app store ratings among all major shopping apps, including Amazon's. And we are profitable. But things were different this time last year. Distressing news about coronavirus reached West in January. It triggered a wave of fear, uncertainty, and anxiety. Word got around that you could catch COVID if you touched parcels from China. Silly as it may sound, but we saw 50% decline in orders caused by this fear. Then lockdowns in China came. People couldn't get to work. Plants and factories were put on hold, as well as first mile logistics. The fulfillment time dropped dramatically. And then merchants started calling off their orders, since they were not being able to restock their inventories. Airlines began canceling flights. And when we thought that we'd seen the worst, lockdowns in Europe came. We got disruptions in last mile delivery. As a result, GMV fell another 25%, around three times from January peaks. We were punched in the guts from three different sides. The demand side, customers were frightened to buy things from China. The supply side, fulfillment got problematic. The logistics, traditional logistics channels were stopped. By all means, it was the greatest challenge we had ever faced as a company. And the worst of it was uncertainty. We had no idea for how long it would last, how we dealt with the crisis. First of all, we created a crisis management center. We had been meeting for every single day for three months before the situation stabilized. During those meetings, we were reviewing every bit of information available in order to make decisions. Our first priority was to solve the demand side issues. We literally had to convince people that it was totally safe to buy things from China. Gosh, we started sending regular newsletters about COVID, published HWHO recommendations, informed about logistical status in every country and every sub-region within a country. We explained what we had done operationally to improve safety measures and so on, so forth. We even created a quiz about COVID and its effects to deliver information in a more engaging way. Secondly, we were monitoring products with increased demand like masks and sanitizers, and try to do our best to find those products and get all relevant certifications. There was little we could do to solve burning problems on the supply side, but we could limit its effects on customers. So we intensified our daily communication with merchants regarding their inventory levels and started to redirect traffic manually to those products which were more likely to be delivered on time. Thanks God we have Joom Logistics. We knew that Joom Logistics was great, but it really shined in the middle of the crisis. We never stopped shipping products when most of our competitors were not been able to even make their products fly out of China. We managed to do it since we had multiple logistical channels to every single country, and we could switch traffic between those channels in real time. When some flights were canceled, we transferred products to other available ones just on the spot. We booked new flights immediately when they were available. We even started using passenger planes as cargo and switched to trains when it was almost impossible to fly to Europe. Over the course of those three months, we did more than we had done in the previous four years in many respects. And I learned the hard way of the depth of Nietzsche wisdom. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger. In the heat side, COVID became the catalyst for major changes since June birthday. COVID crisis made us much stronger and laid a solid foundation for our strategy to be the most reliable cross-border marketplace on Earth. 2020 turned out to be a very successful year in other parts of Joom Group as well. In November, we finally received the financial license for JoomPay project. It took us almost two years 
and it was one of the most challenging projects in my life. I'm sure that Junpei will transform financial services industry in Europe, just like Alipay did in China. We also started a number of new ambitious initiatives that enable us to make further steps in our mission to help merchants serve their customers globally. One of them is going to be announced today. Stay tuned. But before we jump to the new initiatives, I'd like to talk about the major milestones in 2020 and give you an idea of what to expect in 2021. Let me introduce my colleagues Vitaly from Hong Kong and Irina from Riga, who will help me run the show today. Hi, I am Irina, and I am responsible for business development here in Europe. Hi, everybody. I'm Vitaly, and I'm developing Zoom business in Asia Pacific. Let's, Let's zoom, zoom in. in. As a product team lead, please tell us what news and updates of the app are there for 2021? Hi, Irina. Sure, I'll be glad to tell you what is happening inside Zoom app. Together with my team, we are developing Zoom app for our customers. Comfort of our users is what our team values most. And we want to make our customers happy with superior service at every single level. Our app is so convenient that even my granny enjoys shopping with it. Our customers, including my grandma, are looking for ways to save money on regular purchases or to find extraordinary goods which are difficult to find nearby. And our mission is to prove that you don't have to sacrifice your comfort for a discount or a rare find. Joom is like a superhero, and one of its superpowers is loyal users. And loyalty can only be achieved by honest and high-quality service. Thus, we build a product which reflects our values. It is transparent, clear, easy to use, and provides superior customer service. When we first launched Joom, we focused on simplicity, so that nothing distracts a user from shopping. And it works, which is proved by many comparative surveys of our customers, who confirm they choose Joom as it is the most easy-to-use app. In 2020, we decided to give Joom a brand new look using all up-to-date technologies, even more lightweight, even more distinct. The work started in 2019, and in 2020, we added a lot of nice features to our app. Our main driver for the redesign was the need of detox and systematization. Detox is the way to get rid of outdated design elements, and systematization is an opportunity to improve our product much quicker. So far, our main goal was not only to provide our users with a clear interface, but to give them the right feature in the right place at the right time. For example, if a user is searching for smartphone accessories, we offer him quick filters compatible with his phone model. Another one looking for a dress will find options to specify its length and style. The need for detox fully meets our general concept of maximum ease and consciousness of the interface. We want the user to pay no attention to the interface, but to get the most comfortable shopping experience. Our users differ a lot. Some of them want to learn every product feature or order detail. Others want to know the least possible. So do the products. Some of them need detailed descriptions. Others require pictures and videos. We redesigned Joom in a way that lets us adopt to each specific need. All that helped us to increase our conversion rate by 15%. In combination with a great redesign, we set a course for high-quality service. Our main goal was to exceed expectations of our customers. While it was quite a challenge in 2020, the year has changed all of them. We decided to work through every step the user faces. Our starting point was the first session experience. We realized the importance of informing our new customers about the service while entering new markets and offering superior customer service. We are eager to give more than they expect. Free delivery, various goods from a great number of countries, social e-commerce. Besides, there are so many products on Zoom that we have to make sure everyone is able to find exactly what they are looking for. Thus, we try best to balance between machine learning algorithms and user customization 
to offer truly personal experience. As a result, we increased GMV of our new users by 19%. That's why we work hard to provide the best service for the most valuable users. We have launched special bonuses for our loyal users. They are closed sales, early access to the best deals, free upgrade to premium shipping, and more. It helped us to grow GMV of our loyal users by 7.5% and to grow their average number of purchases by 10.5%. Actually, we can't imagine high-quality service without quality products. We make sure that the best features of our products are highlighted and our users know everything they need to make decisions considering the purchase. You may wonder, what about social e-commerce? No surprise that one of our major projects of 2020 was live streams, which is my granny's favorite, by the way. We wanted to push social e-commerce to a new level and inspired by Chinese success, we made a bet online streaming. We went live for the first time in May with our Q&A session and it was a huge success. We received a lot of positive feedback from our users, which proved that we are going the right way. Then we held the first live stream selling products and noticed 20 times growth of sales during the stream, with long-lasting effect of double growth afterwards. It took place only during the alpha testing of the feature. Since then, we've launched live streaming for all our Android users and held two days of non-stop streams on 11.11 and Black Friday. Now we have 25 influencers and five professional TV hosts broadcasting at least twice a week. As a matter of fact, we are currently at the very beginning of this live streaming path. We are strongly impressed by the level of social e-commerce in China and want social e-commerce to go west in 2021. We are eager to build a strong, effective connection between our influencers and merchants. On the one hand, local influencers know all nuts and bolts of their markets, but they have no products. On the other hand, our merchants have great products, but have to invest a lot of resources in studying local peculiarities. We want to build a bridge of sociality and live streaming between them. It will offer greater selling possibilities for influencers and wider access to more markets for merchants. We have a strong regional focus in 2021 as well. We seek to understand the differences of our users in each country and to give them perfect local experience. And no one but our influencers can help us on this count. Together, we will adopt our product to each region and provide high-quality localized experience. As another direction of created superior customer service in 2021, we are going to provide perfect product purchase scenarios, improving them one by one. We will revise the content of our products, boost high-quality reviews, integrate video and live streaming content. Looking for some inspiration? Want to make a bargain with a limited budget? or maybe hunting for the latest K-pop album. No matter what occasion it is, you are sure to find the best service possible on Zoom. There should be someone to supply buyers with high-quality products, shouldn't there? Hey, Anton, why don't you share some news with us and give us a vision for the merchant side of the platform? Hi, Vitaly. Together with the merchant team, we build a service for merchants that connects them with buyers globally. Merchant product is efficient only when it helps merchants to serve the customer. That's why we believe that a great merchant product should be almost invisible. So our goal for 2020 was to provide transparency and convenience at the highest level. Transparency is a broad term indeed. To us, it's about making all relevant and useful data available for a merchant. In order to be ahead of competition, a merchant should have a deep understanding of what's going on with his products and orders. We know how confusing analytics may get. You need to see sales amount in general, traffic and conversions, promotions data, bestsellers dynamics, and so on. Dealing with complexity is such a pain in the neck that we don't want to overwhelm our merchants. So we started off with analytics. The merchants are able to see key metric dynamics at different slices and breakdowns. Our main advantage is that our data is full and accurate compared to some other self-written tools. Sellers may even deep dive in each product performance details and find insights on conversions and traffic trends. Moreover, if you use other analytics tools, you couldn't help noticing how faster it works in Joom. 
it takes you just a few seconds to switch between screens and compare different contexts of the data. This is possible due to the most advanced tech stack that's running under the hood. Another strong point is our seamless workflow with orders. Our solution allows you to see what orders are considered within this report. You can always refer to the orders and dig even deeper into each part of the order. You start with the sale price and end up with the payment amount, broken down for your convenience. We also provide a clear explanation and relevant links where necessary. Going further, we totally rebuild the payment framework. The same logic is applied as in order details. You get a distinct picture of what is what. It becomes clear to you now what to expect, when the sum was transferred and how it was calculated. Obviously, transparency makes sense only when you get sales. This year, we also work hard to deliver improvements in Joom ads and promotion tools. Wherever people browse on Joom, they see lots of relevant products. But how can you stand out? We offer merchants several ways to get extra exposure for their products, from native advertising via Joom ads to promotion tools. Merchants love these features. Almost half of our merchants adopt our promotion tools and even bigger part of merchants receive extra order via Joom ads. Last year, we met lots of great merchants who were willing not only to grow their sales, but to develop their relationship with customers. Not only they sell amazing products, they care about quality and brand development. Merchants from China, Korea, Turkey, Europe take time to showcase their products and create a store that stands out. Just have a look at these store fronts. Those who follow Joom from the beginning will notice a huge difference in images quality and average item value. This is a very different kind of merchants. We call them top stores. We see them as a great opportunity and will focus our efforts on developing a top stores ecosystem in the near future. Lots of existing merchants have already obtained top store status, and we welcome more to come. Imagine you are developing a beauty brand. After you obtain top store status, you immediately have your store highlighted on the product page. It helps you draw extra traffic to other store products and ultimately grow your sales. Then you get to the Stores tab and become highlighted in the relevant search results. Without even moving a finger, it happens automatically. I can't help mentioning that extra traffic will follow to your store page. To convert this traffic effectively, you may customize the way products are grouped on the store page so that visitors have a quick way to discover your products. To retain new customers, you'd need to make them follow you because followers receive push notifications and email notifications about your store updates. To make it happen, you create a subscribe to the store promotion. Every visitor is encouraged to follow your store in exchange for a discount. Another way to convert visitors is to create a promotion for your products. This type of promotion will be shown in a very special way on the product page. In addition, you can create a group purchase promotion. Group purchase should help you get more sales in bulk. I know, that's already a lot, but believe me, this is not all we've got for you. Top stores will be the first to get access to newly developed features like live streams, product videos, special Joom Ads campaigns for top stores, and so on. We see top stores growing fast. They have been claiming a larger share of GMV for a few quarters already. According to the forecast, it will grow even further and we will do our best to help them succeed. We believe that top stores are Joom's future not only in 2021, but also in years to come. That is why developing the ecosystem for them will be our top priority. Join Joom to become a top store and build your global brand. Now it's time for marketing. Let's welcome Anna and Vera, our queens of sales and promotions. Hi, my name is Anna, and our product team has been working for the whole year to make June sales very special and ambitious. Hi, I'm Vera. It is well known that our customers use Joom to quickly find awesome products at low prices. And I'm here to help them discover interesting goods with high ratings and discounts to make their shopping experience versatile and exciting. That's also the main goal of our team, which organizes monthly, weekly and daily sales for our customers all over the world. Not a day without cool shopping ideas. And here is my colleague Anna, who made our big sales possible. Though we had already held large promotions previously, in 2020 we aimed to succeed with the largest sales in Joom history. And we did it. 
Personally, I am very enthusiastic about the idea that despite the challenges of the previous tough year, we managed both to satisfy our customers with the best deals and to help our partners grow with us. To begin with, I'd like to thank you all for your interest in Joom sales. Only driven by your active participation, we managed to make our sales various, regular and really popular among our customers. Here are some milestones and interesting facts about our regular sales. In March 2020, we began to organize sales on a regular basis. We had new daily and weekly sales every week. Fancy that! Since then, we have made more than 400 sales. In September 2020, we held the Merchant Satisfaction Survey and 86% of respondents were satisfied with our promotional activities. They mostly considered our promo tools as effective, various, easy to use and available for a multi-country market. We were proud to get high appreciation and now we are working hard to make your experience even better. Our promotional activities helped customers to find great products and Joom sellers to boost their sales during the promo time. Here on the graph you can see spikes. They show average sales growth during the promo campaigns. For some merchants, the promo channel became the most important tool in the first month of its existence because we did our best to promote only good quality products and provide customers with relevant information about the discounts when they took interest in promoted goods. This diagram shows average share of the merchant sales from the promo channel in comparison with other types of discounts which are available on Zoom. And here we can see the difference in sales volume between regular periods as flat sections and promo periods as spikes. I must admit that our promo activities often help to increase sales not only during promotions, but afterwards as well. In addition to promotional spikes, you can see ascending trends between them on the next graph. Participation in Joom sales encourages products to be better explored, stimulates ratings and attracts more attention to merchants. This tool effectively stimulates sales in the long run. Along with sales, in particular and mixed categories, we began to organize Brands Weeks in September 2020. They are special promotions for particular brands with all possible promo support. Brands Weeks are great for both famous and new brands because they help our customers to identify brands on the platform and get acquainted with their assortment. We tried to carry out such brand weeks for some brands on a regular basis and achieved great results. You can see them as spikes on the next graph. In the near future, we are going to make more sales like that. Stay tuned. Now let's talk about the big sales. We have held four huge sale events since June. All of them were accompanied by a marketing support. For the first time in June's history, we supported each big sale across all communication channels. On TV, YouTube, Facebook, via bloggers on Instagram, and naturally in the app. We used unified design and creatives at the same selection of products in each channel. Our first big sale was June's birthday. A very nice cake became its main character in the marketing campaign. June's birthday sale was 50% bigger than in 2019. November sales became the most successful in 2020 and the entire history of the company, 11.11, was 47% bigger than last year. Black Friday sale was 20% more successful than in 2019. Both sales were followed by a funny shopping cart mascot. It greeted our users while entering the app and visiting product cards. The shopping cart mascot was also used to create YouTube videos, ads on Instagram and Facebook. Let's watch the reel. This November the 11th on June, the sale of the year. Millions of great products are waiting for you. Start filling your cart now with all the things you love. So you don't miss our exciting discounts on November the 11th. Download Zoom now. January sale was the first sale festival of the year. It grew by 45% compared to an ordinary sale. Every event set a new standard and new record in figures. We managed to involve 
as many users into the sale as it had never been before. Just imagine, almost every second user purchased at least one item during the 11.11 sale. It became possible because we focused our effort on preparing customers for the sale. We helped them to find the best deals and to be sure that the prices are the most favorable during the sale. We made several improvements in our product to reach the goal. First of all, in cooperation with our partners, so you, merchants, we implemented a price freeze which guaranteed the best price for customers during the sale. And according to our research, more than 70% of users were satisfied with the prices and offers they had received. Secondly, we added a special pre-sale period when we introduced special offers to users and suggested saving them into the cart or as favorites, so that later users could catch those promoted items at the sale. As a result, users who had prepared for the sale in advance showed seven times higher conversion compared to those who hadn't. Finally, we added a lot of interface elements that helped users navigate in the app, find the best deals and emphasize the amount of benefit they receive. We also marked all the products that participated in the sale and drew users' attention to them as it was the best value for the offer. Hence, product participated in sale got at least 10 times bigger sales than those which weren't marked with the sale signs. Moreover, all our activities in the app and in the web proved to increase overall sales during the event more than by 11%. As you can see, the results of our promise are rather impressive. But the farther, the better. We aren't going to stop there, are we? That's right. Let's have a look at our plans for 2021. We are going to make more regular sales, including special promotions for brands, stores and new products in cooperation with sellers. We are not going to stop with the big sales either, and we are planning lots of them. We will focus on items with good discounts and preferred categories. Inspired by the success of June birthday sale, we are sure to involve users in sale activities based on our own occasions and make them impactful. These two goals will help us make shopping experience on June even more worthy. We will be able to focus our customers only on profitable offers and they will be able to choose high quality goods. And now let's see how we help our customers to make their choice. Choose passion, choose lipstick, choose words. Choose heels, choose head over heels. Choose the complete package. Choose for one day, choose forever. Choose tradition. Choose your own vibe. Choose desire. Choose fun. Choose to party hard. Sometimes you'll forget what you chose. But that's okay. Choose something new. Choose both. Choose the ordinary. Choose the extraordinary. Choose the real you. Choose to shine. Choose what makes your heart beat faster. Choose durable. Choose flexible. Choose to stand your ground. Choose to fight your corner. Choose your target. Choose your look. Choose your style. Choose your identity. the power to choose great things. So keep on choosing products verified by June.
speaking about quality, Yuri, how do you provide goods verification by Droom? Is it true that you test items with your own hands? Let me tell you how Droom verification is arranged step by step. Since the very beginning, I have been responsible for attracting new consumers to the platform. And we have been rather successful these years. Please have a look at the graph that illustrates our sustainable growth in the number of users and installs of the app. We are proud to be shipping in more than 100 countries by now. I love Zoom, and I always manage to find some nice goods, which turn out to be much cheaper than at other e-commerce services. Still, we all get disappointed when our expectations don't match reality. I am not an exception. Once I received a defective tablet. I was so much upset with it that the best thing I could do was to cut it into pieces with my wood chopper. As the Zoom co-founder, I made a very important decision at that very moment that I don't want any consumer to face such situation ever again. According to our research, the main consumer criteria for online shopping, especially at marketplaces, are the product has consumer feedback and photos. Almost all marketplaces evaluate product quality based on customer reviews. Our data scientists have developed sophisticated algorithms to rank products based on user feedback. The product itself corresponds to its description and seller's photos. The latter has become a painful point of all cross-border marketplaces so far. Consumers are most likely to churn or switch to another marketplace when they face this mismatch. For many years, it's been impossible to solve the issues. So our team set a very ambitious goal to become the most reliable cross-border marketplace in the world. We realized that even the most complex algorithms need human help. For that purpose, in 2020, we started a manual quality checking service. We became the first marketplace to verify products before shipping to customers. Let's see how it all works. First, we take photos and measurements of such goods as clothes and shoes at our logistics center in Shenzhen, in the country of origin, China. Then our moderators compare them with photos and sizes provided by the seller. At the same time, complex products such as electronics and cosmetics require a more implicit inspection. We have it performed by employees of a specialized company. They test actual product performance and compare with the stated specifications. A verified product icon is added to the cart if no problems with the product are detected. We make detailed descriptions in most languages for verified electronics. We strive to sell only verified products on Zoom. Sellers of their own brands should ensure quality of products by default. Therefore, they get the greatest benefit from our focus on reliability. The following graph shows the share growth of branded goods sales in smartphones and health and beauty categories in 2020. Nevertheless, it was only the first step. In 2021, we are going to launch a number of game-changing initiatives considering product quality check in the industry. We are aimed at providing both best price and proper quality. Joom's consumers will not only be able to buy goods cheaper than in local e-commerce shops, they will be much more satisfied with the quality of their purchases as well. To sum up, I'd like to stress that merchants with high-quality goods have great opportunities to grow with Zoom. Welcome on board. Reliability of Zoom is our key priority, which comprises high quality, supreme customer service, and effective logistics. All of them require lots of efforts, but are worth it.
logistics turned out to be a real headache in 2020. So, how did we manage it? Hello, my name is Dmitry and I am head of Joom Logistics. Logistics is the heart of not only an e-commerce business, but the whole worldwide economy. Joom's strategy is to be the most reliable cross-border marketplace. To support this, Joom Logistics has a very ambitious mission to make anyone in the world capable of getting any product from anywhere in the world in less than one week. As Ilya mentioned, 2020 was a tremendous challenge for logistics all over the world. Unexpected border clothings, regular lockdowns in a region and destination countries, flight cancellations without prior notice, and many other issues. But we proved to ourselves and to millions of our customers that we are partner you can rely on even in the most difficult times. Thanks to our extensive delivery network, a huge number of delivery channels and backups at each critical area, we achieved what seemed impossible. Average delivery time was reduced to 10, 14 days from order creation to final delivery. We reached a close to zero non-delivery rate. We substantially diversified logistics channels, adding more options for customers to get their goods out of an origin country as well as to deliver them on the last mile. This allowed us not only to hedge the risks, but also to give more convenience to customers, for example with Pudo delivery. As a result, merchants are also pleased with Joom Logistics and rate us very high. According to the recent survey, logistics is one of key advantages at Joom, and we are proud of that. Happy customers, happy merchants and happy team make our dreams come true. In 2020, we kept on striving to provide the first-class service. In several selected countries, we got rid of partially tracked parcels, enjoying 100% fully tracked service. In other words, answering your question, where the hell is my parcel? Now we can say exactly where it is, instead of saying, well, it is somewhere in the Paris area. We are working on adding more countries to the list. Moreover, we made significant progress with parcels consolidation. Now every second Joom order ends up to be in consolidated parcel. This allows us to better manage parcels delivery and give better service to our customers. So there is no need to go to the postal store twice. All orders will be consolidated in one good-looking parcel. We also speeded up the delivery. Today, most of the orders are delivered just within two weeks. Not bad, given regular lockdowns and other exciting issues the pandemic surprised us with. In addition, we launched non-delivery insurance service for merchants. Now Joom covers losses from non-delivery. That was the merchant's most awaited feature, according to the recent surveys. You said, and we did. Finally, given all improvements above, we even managed to decrease logistics costs. Wait, wait, wait. Once again, we improved our service and reduced delivery time. You might expect our logistics prices to soar. The magic is that we decrease them, in fact. Imagine top-tier logistics at a reasonable price. Since then, we have brought our excellence to other countries. Excellent Korean products reach the world with the launch of Joom Logistics Korea. European sellers now can enjoy a fast, reliable and affordable logistics service of Joom Logistics Europe to deliver their goods within the European Union and to Russia. Our service is usually much more affordable than traditional delivery channels having at least the same performance. I strongly recommend you to try it. Joom Logistics Turkey brings quality Turkish clothes and textile to every house around the world. And finally, Joom Logistics Mars delivers essentials to the first colonists. But today I won't share all the details of our new destination. So overall, I am delighted to say, 2020 was one of the most successful years despite the global challenge and raised the bar for the next year. In 2021, we are ready to make yet another breakthrough in delivery service. Our plans are ambitious. Getting faster, we aim to provide a guaranteed two weeks delivery to any destination. If you don't get your order within 14 days, take your payment back and our money excuse. Which means on the 15th day, 
you will have both the tidy order and its delivery for free. Fast, reliable, resistant to any pandemic and trustworthy logistics service at a reasonable price. Sounds attractive? So we are happy to share it. In 2021, we want to bring our logistics service to the market. On top of that, we will offer a fulfillment service run by Joom Logistics. Now, every seller can focus on their core business and Joom Logistics will take the hassle out of storage, fulfillment and delivery. To wrap up, last year brought a lot of challenges, but we managed to turn them into our benefits and became who we are now, a new generation cross-border logistics company pioneering in tech-driven delivery management. And now everyone can try it. Sign up here and enjoy a special offer for a trial period. The service can be used for orders outside your marketplace, other platforms, your own website, for drop shipping, and so on. You just run your own business, and Joom Logistics takes care of fulfillment, delivery, and other logistics stuff. Each new client for us is a separate business with individual requests and needs. So we are trying to offer a quite personalized service. Fill out the form and our manager will contact you, clarify all the details and make sure that none of your puzzles is lost. Our mission is to help people and businesses around the world to solve their daily tasks. We keep asking ourselves, how can we do things more efficient, bring transparency, simplify things? Innovation is in our DNA. We just love building new things. And today is no exception. Well, it's time to announce our biggest news. Hello, my name is Lisa. Together with my team, I'm launching a brand new business inside Joom Group. Having built Joom from scratch and being in business for five years, we couldn't help noticing that there is a field of e-commerce industry which is much less client-oriented and progressive than B2C cross-border sales. I'm talking about B2B cross-border wholesaling. While B2C e-commerce platforms provide smooth, one-click and it's done experience for their customers, B2B wholesale buyers' worries are only appearing after clicking a buy button. Checking products quality, arranging suitable logistics, preparing documents for the bank and contracts for merchants, passing through customs, and much more. These are the things an average B2B wholesale buyer needs to take care of to receive the goods ordered overseas. Having the right experience and assets in e-commerce business, we decided to help them. We are introducing Joom Pro. What is Joom Pro? We are going to provide smooth under lock and key experience for B2B customers who want to buy large quantities of products overseas. Meaning we are going to take care of everything so that our B2B clients can get the same simple one click and it's done experience which we already provide at our B2C platform. Through our one destination website, customers will be able to choose from different factories and merchants, which will be carefully chosen by us. We will check the quality of products before the shipment. We will organize the whole delivery process of goods with our safe and fast Joom logistics. We will take care of all customs procedures, including even the certification of products. And we will prepare all the necessary documents for fast and problem-free money transfer from one country to another. So what's happening at Joom Pro right now? We are launching MVP in the first quarter of 2021. So it's going on pretty soon. 
But even before launching the platform, a great deal of interest from merchants and factories all over China has been taken. We have already received more than 200,000 SKUs in needed categories. However, even more impressive is the reaction of the market and our potential clients. We have got hundreds of applications from B2B buyers before launching the product. We already have several deals which our sales managers closed without a working website. This fact makes us excited the most. We know that we are building something that the market truly needs. You might be interested in geography of our service. We will start from delivering goods from China to Russia, but already this year we are planning to get first shipments from China to Europe. These are some pretty impressive plans, and we are working hard to make them a reality. If you want to join us right now, I will guide you how to do it. We are looking for merchants and factories to become our partners in June Pro. What are the selection criteria for such merchants? They must be reliable, have good quality products, be able to fulfill big quantities of products fast, have experience in B2B wholesale market, and of course, offer reasonable pricing. See more details on merchant.zoom.pro. Thank you, Lisa. Thank you, team. Today, we have learned a lot about Zoom. And now it's time to step forward. Over the last four years, we built Zoom from scratch into a truly international and profitable business. We've got financial license in Europe. Zoom Logistics has started offering its services to external clients. Finally, today we've announced Zoom Pro that will bring simplicity and transparency into a cross-border B2B market. But this is just the start. And I promise you today that every year we meet, we announce another major service that is bound to make a difference for people and businesses around the globe. Thank you all for joining us today.